We're at Eye Medical Equipment and Service, and we're looking at surgical stretchers, eye stretchers, also referred to as head and neck stretchers. And uh, we're looking at some of the most popular models right now that are coming out in the used refurbished market, including the Stryker 1079s, which we have right here in front of me. And then towards the back of the uh, photo here, we also have the Stryker 1089s, which are also part of the Prime Series stretchers. Now, the um, Stryker stretchers, the Stryker eye stretchers, um, come with optional features. Um, the the um, IV pole here at the bottom, that is an optional feature, so those come with some of the stretchers. But as you go through here, you'll see that different hospitals equip them different ways. Um, most of them have the push handles right here. But as you can see, one of the hospitals that we got these from did not equip the bottom with the push handle. And then you've also got the uh, head pieces up here, which um, these are basically used to help the, the, the um, doctor secure um, the, the head and then also to um, set the arms down so when they're working they have something that they can sort of uh, keep their hand balanced on and uh, that is also an optional feature it's something that you can add but isn't always included so when you're purchasing an eye stretcher or a head and neck stretcher you want to make sure that it's going to be equipped with the attachments that you're looking for so um, you have the pneumatic back area right here which uh, this hand Handle, you simply lift that up and you can raise or lower the stretcher and uh, you do have the collapsible rails so um, just like you'll see here you just lift up on this and this will basically drop the rail down so you can lower the rail if you wish to or you can keep it up and then just like all the striker stretchers you're going to have the uh, kick pedal right here which is going to raise and lower the stretcher and then you're also going to have the uh, the down so when you push it straight down in the middle uh, it's going to bring it straight down and you can do Trendelenburg and reverse Trendelenburg and then also you're always going to have your um, kick brake which when you kick it down on the left is going to lock it if you kick it all the way down on the right it's going to lock it into a steer mechanism and basically keep it to go straight down a hall and then in the neutral position the stretcher can be basically, um, it can be moved in any direction. So the Stryker 1089 and Stryker 1079 stretchers are some of the most popular stretcher used in hospitals around the United States. Uh, as you can see, we have a lot of these in stock. We also carry the Stryker 1068 and 1069. Uh, once again, these are the 1079 and 1089s, but the 1069 and the 1068 models are basically all the same. They have what's called a, um, a dual articulating headpiece. This one here is a little bit higher, but you can manipulate and adjust the head and neck section of the stretcher by simply pulling these out and you can adjust the positioning. And the Stryker 1069 has those. Many of the Stryker 1068 units also have those. Uh, those were developed on the Stryker 1068 stretchers, so all 1069s have them. A lot of the 1068s do. So if you're looking for something for an international hospital or for an international surgery center or um, any type of surgery center that basically is doing head and neck or s different types of surgical procedures. These are going to be some of the best uh, stretchers you can buy in the used refurbished market. So for more information on the Stryker 1068, 1069, 1079, and 1089 uh, stretchers, give us a call at iMedical Equipment and Service. We provide these to hospitals and surgery centers all over the world. You can reach us in San Diego, California at 858-263-4894. You can also reach us in Richmond, Virginia, 804-929-6886. And you can get more information off our website at www.imedicalshop.com. Eye Medical Equipment and Service, we are your one-stop shop for all your eye stretcher, gurney, and medical equipment needs.